Well, a very warm welcome to you on this most pleasantly clear evening. Conditions absolutely beautiful, perfect for the beautiful game. Temperatures are kind as well, no doubt playing a hand in high attendance levels as well as an elevated level of anticipation here. Surely this is the hot ticket going around in this neck of the woods. It surely must be. This is one of the great amphitheatres of the game. You are welcome to it, and indeed to one of the grandest fixtures. Ireland braced for their anthem. Ireland have opted for a 4-4-2 formation. Well, what I like about this system, Peter, is the way in which both central midfielders have to work in tandem. If one opts to go forward, the other sits, and when one moves either side to snuff out an attack, the other will, will hold the central ground. Communication is obviously vital to make it a success, but this team knows what it's doing, and I think we're going to see that reflected. the way forward tracking back like that always appreciated by the crowd well they say that your front lads should be that first line of um, of stopping the opposition and I think he's taken it to another level with his desire to get back and, and help everyone out well that's where he wants it chance to break long and it's played forward tries to locate someone up front to get it forward quickly just brushed off the ball there forward it goes it's a long pass but not the most accurate hoists it forward Hendrick and it's played forward and he's there to clear it oh that is lovely footwork and it's McLean Gets it back. Forward it goes. Tries to get it forward quickly. Hoists it forward. Long tips one through. Forward it goes. Well positioned to make that interception. Up towards the front line. Oh, good interception. And it's played forward. McLean goes looking. Long gets it out to the wing. Well, the crowd going for goal! Trying to get there. Good clearance and very necessary. Coleman pings it out wide. McLean hit into the middle. And that's been levered clear. Defenders on the back foot. 
Looking to hit the front line. McLean. Plays it over to the other flank. And that's left him on the seat of his pants. And the counter is on. Plays it out to the flank. It's got through. Out to the right. No change to the score. Nil nil it remains. Going through. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Dashing forward at pace. That's good progress he's made on the ball. Where to next? Driving on, a real charge here. And that'll go straight through to the keeper. Tries to get it forward quickly. Right through the middle. McLean. Forward it goes. And it's long. He's making a real surge on the left. So who's he picking it? And the shot! Oh, nearly. But nearly is nothing. McLean certainly could have and should have made more of that. Looks to bypass the midfield. And it's hoisted clear. Paul has crossed the line, and it's a throw. Played into the middle. One way of trying to make things happen. There's a few who could follow that example. Coleman. That's been drilled forward. Hoists it forward. That will annoy the manager. They're making themselves too predictable here. Chip through. He's making good use of his strength there. Just refuses to be out-muscled. Oh, that had to be more accurate. Played back in. Who's ball? Who's going to get that? Fires, has a goal! Not this time. Ireland can defend those situations better by stopping the crosser at source. it out tries to get it forward quickly uh, ball needed to be better there it's a wasted chance steered forward that's offside yes it is Gets it upfield. Coleman drives it forward. Oh, well intercepted, really alert to the danger. And it's played forward. It's being played forward. Oh, they're guilty of lacking inventiveness here, it's all broken down. Has he found his man? Well played, he saw that coming. 
forward it goes. He's made sure that that won't get through. Tries lifting it over. Tries to get it clear. The claim plays it forward. get it forward quickly and that's been levered clear the referee's had a look and he's blown his whistle for half time so now the team has broken through but set them up for the want of trying it's been an interesting game up to now here we go again then Ireland can feel really happy with themselves the scoreline doesn't back it up but they've played with urgency and purpose and can't afford to lose patience in this second half. They've got to persevere. And it's hoisted clear. Coleman is there, and he can get that clear. Played in with accuracy, done very well to intervene. Forward it goes. Knocks it away. Well, they could break here. Now it's long, and he's on his way. Deftly done. And, oh, that's too long. Goes direct to the front line. Coleman. Drives it towards the front. Questions were asked. That could spell trouble. The referee's awarded a free kick. Well, you might think he got off lightly. It is just a verbal warning. He's having a go. Oh, that's fabulous! A finish of true class! And finally, he has breathed life into the game! Oh, that is a bit special. Ireland take the lead. Well, whatever the manager said in that dressing room at half time, it's worked a treat. Hendrick. And he's going long. Cut out in the nick of time. Danger averted for now. No routine save. Well, as Tesco Peter, the keeper has just received an A plus grade. Duffy. Coleman. Coleman drives it forward. Yet another to add to football's endless list of could haves and should haves. Uh, that was just poor decision-making and a weak execution. Gets into a dangerous position. Defending was strong and firm. Hoists it forward. And it's played forward. And 
That is as far as they're going to go. Yeah, it's been intercepted, and that will come to nothing. Tries to locate someone up front. Hoists it forward. Questions were asked, but he's given the answers. This defence just doesn't trust itself to, to play a higher line. Frighten the people getting in behind. Yeah, absolutely. It just opens up the opportunity of not only strikers getting behind. It's one! And with the goal at his mercy, a dreadful miss. Oh, look, I don't want to sound too dismissive, but from here, that looks the harder thing to do. Checks on the touchline, a change about to occur. McLean. Forward it goes. Long desperately wants to get on the end of this. He's found his man. Time to deliver. Coleman. Whipped in. And here's the shot at goal! Oh, fine stop from the keeper. Long simply didn't do anything wrong. He was thwarted by brilliance. <laughs> There's going to be another change here. The defence did very well to be able to close him down in numbers like that. They basically suffocated his hopes. Tries to get it forward quickly. Well positioned to make that interception. Hoists it forward. Good stuff. This is better. Well, Jim, there's not too much subtlety or sophistication about this. It really is a question of needs must. Spot on, Peter. Good challenge. He just stood firm. It's wrestled off the ball. And it's played forward. Long gets into a dangerous position. Peter, they have to fight the onset of desperation and keep enough cool heads to still deliver. Forward it goes. Cleared away. And that's been one straight back. Keep calm and carry on. That's the job in a nutshell now. Well, it's along. Islands are clearly looking to kill this game off. It's keeping the ball away from the other end too. Looks to bypass the midfield. Up towards the front line. He's made sure that that won't get through. Ireland are looking to make this one safe. They want to reduce the risk. Battles to win it back. And that's the end of that. It all started well enough. Oh, well intercepted, really alert to the danger. Keep calm and carry on. That's the job in a nutshell now. Goes direct to the front line. Done very well to intervene. Ireland just have to run down the clock. Hoists it forward. 
A long ball, but not especially accurate. Forward it goes. Oh, good interception. That's been drilled forward. And it's McClay. Tries to get it forward quickly. And that's been levered clear. That's not going far. Chooses to go back. Breaks on here. Added time is up, and there goes the whistle. What a game. End to end, it flew by, and in the end, it all came down to just the odd goal. Yeah, it was a, a fairly stern test with very little between two teams that scrapped for everything. And with that, it's time for me to thank Jim Beglin and to wish you a very good evening.